Well, this morning, with the help of National Geographic, we're taking a look at our census. Of course, they change as we get older. There are some steps that we can take to remain sharp. Here is Danny Beckstrom. Here's the bad news. Your senses decline as you age. Eyesight, hearing, even the senses of smell and touch. The good news? Exercising the brain strengthens these senses, just like exercising the muscles strengthens the body. The brain is a very healthy and resilient organ. That's one reason why we really need to be upbeat and positive about taking care of it. National Geographic contributing writer Patricia S. Daniels explored how brain health influences our senses for the magazine's Mind Body Wonder series. Exercise, <laughs> the answer to everything in life, isn't it? Physical activity like walking, swimming, and Tai Chi stimulates our most important organ. Mental exercises like playing games, taking classes, and taking on hobbies can ward off cognitive decline too. Particularly if you're learning a new skill and you know, not something that you've done a million times, but something that takes a little bit of work to, to master. These things really build your neural connections. Even social contact has a surprisingly strong effect. That's a reason not to be isolated and not to be sitting at home in the corner with a screen. You really need to get a variety of stimulations during the day. Use your eyes, use your ears. Patricia said it's never too late for your brain. It will build those new nerve connections until the day you die. You've done nothing but sit in a chair in the corner your whole life. You can still pick up. And stay optimistic. You find that optimistic people live longer than pessimistic people. So you should keep your hopes up always. Danny Beckstrom, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.